So the last thing we're going to make are a couple birds. So using the tear tool, and I'm going to switch to the blue color that we used on the candy. And I want to flip this horizontally, or excuse me, I want to flip this vertically. Using the node tool again, just play around until you get the shape that you would like for your bird. Using the pen tool, create the feet for the bird. Just change the stroke to an orange. Going to increase the size of the stroke and then add on a couple points. And then I'm going to move, move the foot up to the bird, rotate it a little bit. If they look a little big, you can always scale it down, which I actually think I'm going to for mine. And then duplicate. And rotate again, just slightly. And you can leave these so that they are layered in front of the bird. <clears throat> but you can also move them behind, which is what I typically do. And then using the triangle tool, want to create the beak, turn the stroke off. So you could leave the beak just like this. Or you could go in with the corner tool, holding shift select all four, or all three. Just bring this in just slightly. Once again, you could leave it just at that, but I'm going to copy and paste. And then I'm going to layer these behind the body. So now it looks like an open beak. And then to add in eyes, I'm just going to do an oval and white. I'm going to switch this and then turn the stroke off. And then a smaller circle with the color, I'm going to switch it to black. I actually want to decrease the size of the pupil. And I'm going to rotate. Okay, I'm going to make the pupil a little bit bigger. And this is looking a little crooked right now, so I just want to rotate everything. And using the ellipse tool, I'm going to copy and paste, rotate. I want to move this over. And then the one that you rotated, copy and paste and flip horizontally. Select all three, and then at the top right, I'm just going to use the add option. So now it's one shape instead of three. And move this onto the bird. Mm, I don't like the red, so I'm going to use the eyedropper tool and try to get this green. I'll stick with the green. 
So you can come in and you can add some details. You can add a little bit of tail feathers to the bird. Or you could, you know, add in some details for the feathers. But for this, for now, I'm just going to group these and then Command C, Command V to paste. Going to bring the second one over and then flip horizontally. Kind of rotate them again just a little bit. And with the second bird, I'm going to ungroup, switch the body color to green, and then switch the wings to the blue. And select the heart again and duplicate it. Scale the heart down. And duplicate it a few times. And like we did with the stamp, I'm going to scale each heart down as they move up. And I want to group these together. And we have successfully created some Valentine's clip art.